And there goes a plane. Okay, so my plan for today, because the weather's gonna be really nice, is to go out and do some field recording and then come back and make some beats. But instead of going out with one of my Tascam field recorders, I'm gonna start using this. This is the Rode Video Mic Me, and it hooks right up to a phone. Of course, you gotta have a phone that has a headphone jack. I've also got the windscreen for it. They're great, but what I'm finding is there's an old adage in photography, the best camera is the camera that you have, and that follows through with field recording. The best field recorder is the field recorder you have. And if I'm just out walking around, I don't necessarily have one of my Tascam recorders, but I always have my phone. And a little accessory like the Rode Video Mic Me makes it even easier. I don't have to carry a whole separate other device that doesn't fit in my pocket very well. I'm gonna see if I like the workflow. One thing that I already like about just using Apple's voice memo is that you can give titles to things and you can crop things right on the screen. And in the task game, it's kind of a pain to give things titles, so you have to go back and remember what you recorded or put them all into your computer and listen to them all back. With this, I'll be able to record a couple things and then name them and then I'll know exactly what I have when I come back to the studio. So that's the plan. <laughs> going down but I'm at this beach and there's so many like crickets chirping and birds you got a plane going by I'm just gonna try to take a long form recording with the Rode video mic me connected directly to the iPhone there's two types of field recordings I usually get when I'm out there's the one shots so if I hear a cool sound that I think will fit in a drum rack as a percussive sound great that's the one shot and then there's the longer ambient recordings those are just long five ten minute recordings of the atmosphere so let's hear what that sounds like on the road video mic me all right so i cut that recording short because there's some bushes and some trees over here and there are just birds going wild in these bushes so i don't know if there's a nest or what but i'm gonna try to grab it And there goes a plane. Another thing I like about using the Straight Up Voice Memos app is that the step before you finish, it gives you the option to crop. So if I make a ton of noise when I'm turning the phone back towards me and hitting stop, I can just crop that end right out. Saves my ears and also saves me time later so I don't put it in the computer and I don't have to take every single loop and crop out that beginning and end. Just a workflow and a step saver. So while I'm out here, Amplify just released an update for the Groovebox app, which I thought was really cool, but you might have noticed I tweeted out the other day, when are they gonna release MIDI controller support? And they did, Bluetooth MIDI and regular MIDI controller support. So I brought this Seaboard block and I'm just gonna try to make a quick beat with Groovebox and a MIDI controller. All right, so if you remember, I was really worried about traveling with the Seaboard. The surface of it can get dirty really easily and I feel like it could be easily punctured by random things floating in the bag, but luckily, my mom is great at sewing, and I just gave her the dimensions, and she made me this sweet sleeve. So it fits perfectly, and boom, now we can travel safely with the seaboard. I mean, it's not a hard case or anything, but it will at least protect it from things that are in the bag. She even made this side a little more padded for the keyboard, and if it's nice and snug, it's not going to fall out or anything. Boom. Thanks, Mom.